What's up? Welcome back to my channel. Or if you are brand new here, hello and welcome. My name's Jennifer. I share all things health and wellness here on the channel. Anything I do to level up my own life, I share with you guys in hopes to inspire and motivate you to do the same in your own life. So if that sounds like your jam, make sure to subscribe before we jump into today's video. All right, guys, as you could tell from the title, I am sharing another grocery haul and meal plan video with you guys. I am getting ready to go here in just a few and pick up my Walmart grocery order. We have three stores this week. We have Walmart, Aldi's, and Publix. So, like I said, I am getting ready to head to Walmart here in just a few. I'm actually at the gym right now, but as soon as I am done here, I'm going to head and pick up my grocery order from Walmart. Then I'm going to hit up Aldi's and Publix, and I will show you what I get from each of the stores, as well as the meal plan for this week. So, if you want to check out what I picked up this week, just keep watching. All right, we're going to jump right into Walmart. I am back with all of the order. They were out of a couple things, which is okay, because I still have to go to Aldi's and Publix here in just a few, which I will show you right after this haul, but we're going to go ahead and jump into this one. I got some shredded iceberg lettuce just because you guys know this is like super easy to throw on stuff. So I love the shredded lettuce, super convenient. Got a bag of the tricolor coleslaw, which will be for Taco Tuesday, which you guys will see the meal plan in just a moment. Got some of the Smithfield all natural uncured bacon, which I absolutely love, super good. Four bags of the broccoli florets. These are a dollar a piece, super convenient. You guys know we eat broccoli a ton. So got four bags of that. Got a large bag of the raw shrimp, peeled and tail off. That's going to be for shrimp tacos. Got some white cheddar popcorn for the kiddos. You guys know they love that. Got a bag of fresh spinach, some mozzarella sticks for my daughter because she loves them. Four bags of cauliflower, also a dollar a piece. Super awesome. You guys know we go through a ton of cauliflower, so stocked up on that. Got a bag of these halved Brussels sprouts. Love sauteing these up with some onions or bacon bits, avocado oil, a million things you can do with them. Super good. Some more of the organic rainbow baby carrots. I'm going to be making uh, like a teriyaki chicken glaze situation with some carrots. So that should be super yummy. Got a huge bag, five pound bag of the boneless skinless chicken breasts. Some of the Butterball all-natural turkey sausages that you guys know I love. Some more of the Chosen Foods avocado spray. This stuff is just so convenient. You guys know how much I like cooking in the oven on a sheet pan and just super easy spray this on there. Throw everything on and you're good to go. Got some Amy's Organic Chunky Tomato Bisque Soup for my carb up days. Two cans of cut green beans here, as well as one can of the seasoned mixed greens. Another thing of the Primal Kitchen Mayo. Four of the Two Good Strawberry Yogurts. I actually had six, which is the limit they allow you to get, but they only had four left, so they only gave me four. A red onion, which is purple. Why they call it red, I have no idea, but one of those. Some of the Applegate Naturals Uncured Beef Hot Dogs, 100% grass-fed. Absolutely love these. Super easy for lunch. Some green onions, two things of strawberry applesauce for the kiddos, a bag of sweet potatoes, some elbow pasta for my daughter at her request, three of the seedless cucumbers, because you guys know I go through a ton of these, and then just random some dishwasher tabs, wipes, banded for my chicken because it hurt its leg and we have to doctor it up, some razors, deodorant, and body wash, just random stuff there. But that is everything that I got from the Walmart pickup this week, and now we'll jump into all. is good old Aldi's. Not a super huge haul from there this week, but definitely had to get a few goodies from there that I love just from there. So we're gonna go ahead and jump right in. Clearly I didn't get the first form from Aldi's, but we just are running out of room in our cupboard. I need to rearrange it. Anyways, that's beside the point. Couple impulse buys today, and this was one of them. I went by and they just looked like so amazing and tempting and awesome. Stuffed Baby Bella caps with spinach and artichoke cheese. Absolutely love a good stuffed mushroom. Haven't had one in forever, so I went ahead and grabbed those. Got some blueberries, of course. Got some regular sliced mushrooms, cause absolutely love those. Got some more strawberries, because you guys know we go through an insane amount of berries in this house. Got some more grapes for the kiddos, as well as some apples. These were called Wild Twist. It said, where is the thing? Oh, is it on here? Yeah, there it is. 
Two legendary apples have come together in a wild twist. The explosively juicy crunch of honey crisp combined with the intricate flavor of crisp pink creates an experience you won't want to miss. Probably marketing and selling, but it sounded intriguing. I thought the kids might like those, so went ahead and picked those up. Got a three-pack of romaine hearts for the Caesar salads. Got some of their free-range eggs. Got two of the hummuses that you guys know I love from there. I haven't been to Whole Foods to get the Hope hummus, and they've been out of it a lot of times anyway. So I've just been going to the organic hummus from Aldi's, and this garlic hummus is the one I normally get, which is really awesome. They have this red pepper hummus there today, so I went ahead and snagged that one up, and I'm sure it's going to be delish. Got some unsweetened original almond milk. Got some more of the liquid egg whites. These are a really good deal at Aldi's. Absolutely love them, and it's an awesome way to get your protein in without the extra fat, especially on carb up days. So that's always good to get. You guys know that I'm obsessed with the home style guac cups. It's avocados and mixed vegetables, super clean ingredients, two net carbs per cup, and they are delish. This was another impulse buy. Clearly, I went there right after working out and was completely starving and probably not a good plan, but these are awesome. Cocktail shrimp. Went ahead and grabbed that. You guys know I always stock up on the tuna. Six cans of the chunk light in water. Six cans of the solid white in water. I like to mix these equal parts. I just like that texture. It's absolutely delicious, and I need to prep some up for the week. So, got six cans of each of those. I had ordered some wings in my Walmart pickup order, but they were out of them, so I went ahead and just got a bag from Aldi's. They are just as good. Got some ground beef for tacos, and then you guys know that I absolutely love all the pork chops from Aldi's. It's like the best pork chops that I can find, and they're always for a killer deal. I like the thin ones they have. I like the bone-in ones. These are center-cut boneless pork chops, and they are going to be absolutely delicious. Got two packs of those four pork chops and sauerkraut and that is everything that I picked up this week from Aldi's now we'll jump into Publix so Publix is up next not a huge haul at all as you can see this is everything I needed from Publix I actually cheated because I just sent my husband a list and he picked it up on the way home so I didn't even have to go into another store so that's awesome but some rice cakes for the hubby he loves these or sometimes I'll have them on my carb up days but I honestly think they taste like airy cardboard. I don't know. I'm not like the biggest fan of them, but it's a good snack if you want to put nut butter on them. That's what he does. Some mild salsa for tacos. Some nut pods creamer. This is the French vanilla one. I had got some bangs um, or ordered them in my Walmart grocery order, but they were out of them, so the hubby just picked me up two of those. Some of the gingerbread almond Base culture nut butter, which is our fave. Some of these dark chocolate covered blueberries. These are frozen. My daughter absolutely loves these. They are delicious. Some of the crepini egg wraps. Got some thin sliced corned beef from the deli, as well as some thin sliced Harvardi cheese. But this quick little tiny haul from Publix will finish off the stores this week for the grocery haul. Now we'll go ahead and jump into the meal plan. All right, guys, I wanted to go ahead and include this deal in this grocery haul because it is currently going on this week. And it should still be going on when this video goes live. They have in the Target Cartwheel app, if you have the app, it is 50% off for these little Good Culture Cottage Cheese. I got four of these with the pineapple. I got six of the regular and I got eight, nine, ten of these blueberry ones. You can only do four in one transaction and you can do up to six transactions. And I wanted to go ahead and stock up because A, I am stepping up my protein game immensely soon and also because this is just my current obsession right now I just had this one today for the first time and holy smokes like absolutely delicious they are bomb awesome way to get your protein in these ones are 19 grams protein these are 15 grams protein and these are 15 grams protein absolutely amazing super good super clean ingredients like the best cottage cheese out there so definitely a run deal at Target if you guys have the Target cartwheel app and a Target near you definitely go stock up on these and then and also, um, I didn't even realize it last night, but hubby forgot to get some of the True Story smoked turkey breasts from Publix when he ran in there to get the list that I had sent him. So I stopped in there really quick and grabbed some of this. And then also I went ahead and stocked up on a few more of these. My daughter is like obsessed with these. Again, they're dark chocolate covered blueberries and they like sell out super quick at Target. So she wanted me to stock up on them. So got four more bags of these to throw in the freezer. But I wanted to go ahead and include this stuff for you guys so that you guys could get in on the deal too. 
and I know I'll probably get the question on when these are expiring since I stocked up on so many and it is June 6th so it is a month until they expire so I'll definitely be able to go through them in that time okay so now we'll go ahead and jump into the meal plan on Monday night we have teriyaki glazed chicken and carrots it's just going to be a sheet pan dinner throw in the oven with some primal kitchen teriyaki sauce and the chicken and those organic rainbow carrots from Walmart that are super good and gonna pair it with some Kali mash Tuesday, super simple, just doing regular beef tacos on the Crepini egg thins. Wednesday will be buffalo parmesan wings, super easy. One of my favorite go-to meals, absolutely delicious. Thursday will be fried pork chops with a mushroom cream sauce. I'll be pairing it with some southern style seasoned mixed greens, as well as some collie mash. Friday, we will be doing tacos again. Shrimp and slaw tacos with Brussels sprouts on the side. Probably cook those in some avocado oil with bacon or something and onions. And then Saturday, this week's going to be a little different than it normally is. You guys know that Sunday is normally my carb-up day, but since Sunday is Mother's Day, I am taking the day off from filming, social media, everything, and just going to be present with my family. We're probably going to go out to eat with the kids, so not doing my regular carb-up on that day or filming or anything. So I am going to do my carb-up day on Saturday. I am going to be filming it for you guys. Can't wait to show you this. Reuben sandwich with sweet potato fries, and I also have something yummy for lunch planned that day too, so make sure you guys are looking out for that video. And of course, Sunday's Mother's Day, just told you about that. So, and that'll do it for this week's meal plan. Nothing super hard or complicated. You guys know I like to think, keep things simple and easy and delicious. All right, guys, that's a wrap for another grocery haul and meal plan video. This week, it didn't seem hard grocery shopping. Normally, when I run to like a million different stores, it's like a chore, as you guys know to like hit up so many different stores and all of that. But for whatever reason, even though we ended up doing Target, Publix, Aldi's and Walmart, so four stores, which is about the norm for me, it just, I don't know, it didn't seem like crazy. We did the Walmart pickup order, which is always pretty easy for me. I know my girl struggles with the Walmart pickup order. They're always messing up her stuff, Nicole Burgess. If you haven't checked out any of her grocery hauls, definitely go check them out. But I seem to have good luck with it, so fingers crossed as of right now, but it all went pretty smooth and easy. Make sure that you guys are looking out for my future grocery haul and meal plan videos, especially in the next six, seven weeks, because I'm going to be switching up my eating, and I'm excited for it. Different meals, different products, just all the things, and I'm super excited for it, so make sure that you guys are subscribed. Click your bell down below. That way when I upload, you guys don't miss out on them. I'm excited to try some new recipes and just switch some stuff up. But I hope you guys got some ideas from the meal plan or the products that you saw. Definitely run out and get that Target deal. Super, super good deal on that Good Culture. 50% off if you have the Target Cartwheel app. And it still will be going on when you see this video. Um, this is actually Thursday right now when I'm filming this. I've already done this outro once and it messed up. So I'm redoing it again. But... The deal should still be going on when you guys see this video, so definitely go stock up on that. It's an awesome snack, awesome way to get your protein in, so I was super excited to get in on that deal. I might actually go back and see if they restocked and even get more. And also, make sure that you guys are looking out for my next carb up video, because I have some exciting stuff I'm making on that day as well. There was one thing that changed on the meal plan, and that will be Friday's dinner. We were going to do the shrimp tacos, but I'm actually going to push that till Taco Tuesday next week, and just do leftovers this week because we're going to have a bunch of leftovers anyway. So again, that will do it for this week's grocery haul meal plan. If you guys love these videos, make sure to give it a thumbs up. You know that definitely helps your girl out and I always appreciate it when you guys share, comment, like the video, all that stuff. That just helps me out with the YouTube world and I appreciate it more than you guys know. So make sure that you follow me over on Instagram at and with Jen and let me know down below your favorite meal from this week or one that you have on your own meal plan this week. And again, thank you all so very much for watching and I will catch y'all in my next video. Sometimes it really feels like I lose control.